I'm Rashawn the Techie Mentor. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today's Excel tip is how to use autofill to automatically fill a column with the same information over and over again. So a couple ways you can do this the long way. You can copy and paste or you can use the autofill handle which is this handle here in the lower right corner of the active cell. It's kind of got a, what I call a chubby corner. Now you know you can just drag and drop this and it will automatically repeat or autofill the same content over and over within the same column. Now, I want to go all the way to the bottom of my spreadsheet so it fills it up all the way down to this corner right here. So another way I could do that, and I'm just going to do what I did, is I can click and drag. Okay, the problem with clicking and dragging is either you go too far or you don't go far enough. So in this instance, you'll see that I went much further than I wanted. So I'm going to undo that. Okay, so this time I'm going to use what I call the autofill to fill in that entire column all the way down to row 122. So we're going to go all the way down to L122. So I'm going to go over here to the lower right hand corner and instead of clicking and dragging, I'm simply going to double click. Click, click. And you'll see that it automatically filled in that entire column for me all the way down to the very end, which was row 122. It's a great little tip to automatically fill a column with the same information. So for this instance, I just wanted the same email address to run all the way through my document. Now here's the catch. In order for this to work, there has to be information in the column to the left of it. Okay? It has to know where to stop filling. And it does that by checking to see where the end of the content is to the column to the left. So for this instance, this column ended at K122. So when I did the autofill in column L, it knows just to take it to row 122. So remember, this only works if you have data or content in the column to the left of it. Okay? But it is a great shortcut for you. So instead of overshooting or undershooting by dragging the fill handle, you can simply double click and it will fill it for you. So that's my easy tip for today. I hope you found it useful. Keep checking back with us for techie tips on a weekly basis. Thanks again and enjoy your day.